You can bet you've never seen a wheelchair move like this. It's come from a combination of the USF School of Theater and Dance and engineering departments. It felt like a stretch, like they're saying. You know, it felt like, <laughs> is anyone in engineering going to be interested in this? Marilyn Morris from the school's theater and dance department had the idea four years ago while dancing with a mixed ability dance company. Standard wheelchairs aren't built for dancing, and she wanted to build one that is, but it's not like she could draw up the plans herself. So she improvised. Well, it's going to be hands-free chair. It's going to do this. It's going to rotate. It's going to have omnidirections, you know, using a secretarial chair, literally, to, to initially demonstrate this idea. The School Center for Assistive and Rehabilitation Robotics Technology saw the idea as a perfect fit. And what was once just a dream is now a patented reality. The technology itself is relatively simple. However, the impact is really great. What undergraduates were able to create is a hands-free wheelchair for dance. Basically what this chair does, it turns your body into a joystick. So if you want to move forward, you lean forward. If you want to move back, you lean back. It's like a Segway, but a lot simpler, using sensors attached to a bracketing system underneath the seat. Now that it's patented, already students are working on a next generation prototype so this chair could eventually be commercially sold. We've been developing it for dance or recreation, but it can be used for a variety of things, everyday use, exercise, um, rehabilitation. So there's a lot of applications for this particular chair. As you can see, as many as you can imagine. In Tampa, with an extra on special assignment, Jonathan Petromala, Bay News 9.